Hey, it's uh, VJ from Canada, James Marshall, Jimi Hendrix, who was born Johnny Allen Hendrix, uh, an American musician, singer, and songwriter. Although his mainstream career spanned only four years, he is widely regarded as one of the most influential electric guitarists in the history of popular music. He was born in Seattle, Washington, uh, b began uh, the playing of the guitar at the age of one years old. Uh, he enlisted in the U.S. Army, but was discharged the following year for refusing to play at an Army charity gig. Soon after, he moved to uh, Clarksville, Nashville, Tennessee, but uh, was run out of town for uh, being black and uh, playing on the Chitlin circuit. Early in his career, he earned a spot in the Isley Brothers backing band and later with uh, the very gay a Little Richard. Uh, now, supposedly, Hendrix died by choking on his own puke after a night of heavy partying in September 18th, 1970. However, this is a blatant lie uh, fed to you by the mainstream media. But uh, VJ knows what really happened. And here's the story. Uh, Hendrix played a Madison Gardens show in New York City and in, in the audience one particular night was American gangster John Gotti who had a backstage pass to watch what turned out to be Jimmy's greatest live performance ever. Uh, Gotti was invited by the Jimi Hendrix Experience Band to party after the show. John and Jimmy dropped acid together but the trip turned out to be a real bummer. When John requested Hendrix to play Hey Joe for Agati's girlfriend, Hendrix refused and muttered under his breath, No Joe for that hoe. This upset Gotti, who would go on to order a hit on Hendrix for insulting his girlfriend. Uh, Jimmy got wind of the contract that had been put out on his life and decided to fuck off and leave show business for good. Hendrix disappeared for many years, but it turns out he has been hiding in plain sight.